What's up, Amber? Hey. What's new? Getting cold out there, huh? Oh my god. It's yeah. the wind. That's what the problem is. Wind. So this is gonna be our last interview for about a month or so, maybe a little longer. I'm gonna take a little break. Yeah, because the dumbass drone guy. It's just a lot of drama going on, and I just, you know, I don't want to use you for views or First drama. First of all, whoever this so-called Eagles drone guy is, I know who he is. All he cares about is starting a bunch of fucking drama between this interviewer, that interviewer, this one, that one, whoever, whoever. Now, for one, I don't talk shit about Jeff. Jeff is generally my friend and cares about people. He don't give a fuck about what views he gets or how many people see this or see that. He generally cares about these people. Like, Thank you, I appreciate that. You embarrass people, drone, uh, talking shit, you know, starting shit, interviewing people when they're all fucked up and high, like, not caring, like, you care about views. Thank you. I, I try to. It could be a challenge trying to find you when you're not high, though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but no, I appreciate it. I, 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 you are a friend of mine now. You know, there's no other ifs, ands, or buts about it. Like I, I care about you, and I'm gonna take a break doing interviews for a little bit. Um, I just don't want drama you around it either you know i don't it's not fair that we're gonna use you or other people down here for views for drama like, and you don't do that so yeah I, I refuse to do it so i'm gonna i'm gonna take a little break i'll still come down and you know give you some stuff and see you but i'm just gonna stop for the filming for a little bit yeah like boy y'all you are a grown ass man man just wanted to start middle school drama over the internet because what? You're a man because your interview like status isn't up there. Mm -hmm. like, you wonder why. Yeah, who knows. So it's been getting cold out, huh? Very. Um, you've been staying outside every night? Yep. Oh, can I show the jacket that the mm -hmm. person sent? I forgot I who... I love it. I forgot who sent this. But... I just wanted to let you know she did get it, and we real appreciate it. It's nice and soft. You didn't even realize that was for you at first. You no, started, you're like, I, I want that shit right now. I'm like, it's yeah. yours. <laughs> yeah. Um, a quick couple questions. Um, now that the new mayor's here, have you been seeing a lot more people getting arrested again? Um, somebody told me that. <clears throat> that now... If they get you getting high outside, mm -hmm. they can arrest you. Really? For yeah. Nothing. Um, Tori's brother just got arrested for just for possession. Wow. Yesterday. Um, and I, a couple other people. I seen some three girls up at Huntington Station. You know where they usually stand for dates? Mm -hmm. They were, uh, there was a bunch of cops running down on them. And, uh, and then I, I went back around the block like 10 minutes later and they were loading them all in the back of the... Um, oh my god, really? Yeah, three of them. So I don't know what Damn. what that was about. It just seems like it's they're they're starting to be a little more strict down here. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. What's that? Just plain oatmeal or has it got a flavor? Oh man, with cinnamon and sugar. Oh man. I, I got so sick of um oatmeal because we're eating it in jail and rehab all the time. Oh, I think their oatmeal is nasty as shit in jail. Oh, it's horrible. Horrible. I like their cream of wheat, though. Uh, dude, listen. I'm almost ashamed to say it, but I enjoy eating that cream of wheat in there. Like, I mm -hmm. actually like the taste of it. Mm -hmm. What do you put? Butter and sugar on it or salt and pepper? I put butter and sugar. Yeah. And syrup. Yeah, me too. Me too. And they give you that little half-ass turkey sausage piece with it. Yep. <laughs> oh, my God, yeah. You remember what I'm talking about? Yeah. It's like the size of a half dollar. Mm -hmm. It's like this big. Mm -hmm. Little ass. What else did they give you? Just that and then two slices of bread, I think? Mm hmm Always giving you bread with every meal. Yeah. Carbohydrates, trying to make you fat. <laughs> what you got on? What are you wearing? 
sweatpants. How many layers you got on? I got one pair of leggings on, Ugg boots. I have and um. Some hoodies on. Do you want a, another pair of leggings? I have those fleece lined ones. They're like warm. Mm. Or do you want me to hold on to them for to another time? Yeah, hold on, no. All right. Uh, what are they doing with the um? With the fire. Are they letting you guys Every have... Every time one comes up, one is getting lit, they tell us to put it out. That's that quick? They're doing it that quick? Mm-hmm. Or the fire trucks are coming in using their hoses to put it out. Damn. Mm-hmm. Damn it. Did you get any Thanksgiving food at all by any chance during mm-hmm. Thanksgiving? Did you... Mm-hmm. Oh, you did get some turkey? So, so not like they had platters like yams and like greens. You like the sweet potatoes, right? Yams, mm-hmm. I fucking love them With things. Mashed potatoes, some turkey, and some Spanish food. Nice. Jamaican food. I went to uh, I didn't. I, my my mom decided not to cook at the last minute, so I didn't even get Thanksgiving this year. But I, I went down to Chinatown. How about it? Good. Good. I had what I have. Um. Oh, wonton noodle soup. Roast pork wonton noodle soup. You like dumplings? I I love dumplings. Oh my God. I could eat dumplings nonstop. I eat chicken and dumplings. What about the Chinese dumplings? Mm Mm-hmm. We have fried dumplings. You like fried or steamed? Which one do you like better? Either one. Yeah. I I used to like fried, but now that I have no damn teeth, I get the steamed ones because they're easy to eat. I actually had a steamed uh, dumpling last night. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, with the meat in the middle. Yeah. You like chicken and dumplings too, like the American version? Yeah. Oh my god. Mm. That's good. I like fried, fried wonton. Yeah. I can't, man, my, without having teeth, it's hard to eat stuff like well, that. No. Now. I gotta get my bottom denture. See if that works again. I only had the top one, so I can't really eat with them in, you know? Yeah. You still planning on getting out for the start winter time? Are you falling asleep? I'm going to end this if you're falling asleep. No. Yeah. Are you uh, still trying to, thinking yes. about getting out? Yes. All right. I can't do it. Mm-hmm. I, I can't do this. I think that just this wind is bad for me. Oh, no. I can already tell I'm not going to be able to handle it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, I genuinely hope you uh, reach out and go to the program. Me too. I know, I'll drive you there, whichever one you want to go to. Oh, can we just get this out of the way right now? Uh-huh. Did I ever talk you out of going to Florida? No. I told myself I wasn't going because all they give you is them corny ass comfort meds mm-hmm. that don't do shit. They don't put you on methadone to keep to keep you well when you're going when you're there. Mm-hmm. Or suboxone. I'm not going there I'm going to withdraw without anything helping me. Yeah. So I decided to myself not to go. All right. And you do you know I would I would have driven you down there mm-hmm. if you really wanted to go myself, right? I know. Okay. You never tell no one not to go somewhere to get help. Yeah. Everyone's like yelling. That's why I got so mad and started this whole drama. Everyone's like, I'm tell- talking you out of fucking... No. Not know. at all. I, I, I want you to get help. I want you to get better. Yeah, not at all. So I'm going to... For a little bit, I'm going to concentrate on... I'm going to do Camden interviews for a little bit, and I'm going to start making documentaries. I'm going to make, like, a documentary mm-hmm. about Camdenton. If I do that, will you do interviews in the documentary? Oh, well, hell yeah. All right, cool. Cool. I'm going to start that That'll this That'll be cool. Yeah. yeah. Not, like, just the interview, but, like, a whole the history of Camdenton and, like, the drug, mm-hmm. you know, the drug war yeah. down here and all that. I think that'll be good to do. hmm So. All right, pretty girl. Um... Thank you for doing this. No problem. And so the people now know that you probably won't be interviewed for a while on my channel, but I'll still come down here to visit you and mm-hmm. maybe we'll do a quick ones every, you know. Mm-hmm. All right, sweetie. Bye, guys. All right. So, 
you went back to the hospital again? Yeah, I actually called the ambulance myself. Because, again, I'm having tough things right now. Mm hmm. <sighs> what are you saying? You're having actual chest pains? Yeah, right now. Like, my, inside my heart. Really? Yeah. Damn. It yeah, hurts right here. And what they do? Uh, you said they did an EKG? And yeah. What, and what they say? Nothing, nothing. Nothing's wrong with me. And they, they actually released you. Yeah, I was there for five minutes. I mean, it, this wasn't you AMA in. No. You genuinely. They, I have discharged papers and all. Oh wow. Hey yeah yeah. So yeah, it was yesterday you went in. Yeah. And then they asked me, "Oh, when was the last time you used?" I said, "I just used." Mm hmm. <sighs> And I guess maybe they just judged me and was like, oh, well, she don't need to be here. She's just... Yeah, I don't know. Um, but they did do the EKG to make sure your heart... Yeah, but... Where'd you go, Episcopal? Yeah, yeah very ignorant. Very ignorant. We just took some pics in the park. Uh, I want to... Um edit them nice. Yeah, do that. So I got some pictures of you. I wish I would have taken pictures when we first met. I know. And then when we first met and till now, like, how the difference is. Mm -hmm. You lost a lot of weight. But that's about it. I seen the one interview at the first one I did. I don't know if you remember. You probably don't, but we did it right here. Yeah. And, and, um... Tiger Park. Yeah, I remember. You had the uh, big Adidas jacket on. <clears throat> uh huh. But. Oh. What's your plans for the weekend? Just oh. staying out of trouble, hopefully. Yeah, I went home and slept last night. Did you? Yeah. How was that? Nice and get some good sleep. Yeah. Ow. That's why you were texting me at six in the morning, huh? Yeah, but. I kept waking up sick, so I had to keep doing my dope. Mm. I mean, we bought Wendy's, and of course, I fell asleep with the Wendy's bag on my bed, <laughs> and my fucking dogs ate it. <laughs> they ate all my loaded fries, my burger, everything. I was pissed. Really? I am. I don't, I'm not a big fan of Wendy's. It's all right. I want to try their loaded nacho burger. I get the Junior Bacon cheeseburger all the time. I don't like oh. They used to be a freaking dollar. Yeah, they used to be good. I, I don't like them no more. They're like three something now. I, yeah. I, I stayed up <laughs> during my addiction. I man, I was I ate there all the time. Yeah, but yeah. you can get full for like you used to be able to get like full for like four bucks. Yeah. Mm. I don't like them no more. No. No, I'm not. You like checkers though. Yeah. I went, after I took you there the other day, after I dropped you off, I was like, man, that looked good. So I went and got my own afterwards. Yeah, it was good. My appetite hey, just... That chili cheese dog was good there. Yeah. I was surprised. But my appetite's been messed up. I just eat a lot of junk food. Yeah. Like goldfish, you know, cakes. Yeah. I, uh, I used to, when I was getting high, I had the biggest sweet tooth. Yeah, when I first came down here, I went over hanging out with Somerset. Uh-huh. I would never spend my money on food. No, just drugs. Always on drugs. <laughs> yeah, I used to I just like started that. buying clothes, yeah. food. Well, that's what I do for food. I just find the cheapest thing to eat possible. I spend all my money on the important stuff. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you ever heard of the Appalachian Trail? No. It's a, a trail through the woods. It goes from uh, Georgia all the way up to Maine. It's like 2,000 miles long, or 1,000 uh, miles. And people walk that? Mm hmm. What? That's like yeah. a five day walk. It's five days, it's like a seven month walk. Six seven month. month walk? Yeah called the through hike oh hell no i'm thinking about doing it what yeah it's a little crazy like camp that. out and sleep and wake up and walk and then yep 
No, no. <laughs> that doesn't sound fun to you? No. Walking from Georgia to Maine? That's too much. <laughs> Too far. I want to do something fun like that though, something yeah, like crazy. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, like it's you an, know, it's an experience. I did all this work getting sober, and I'm just sitting around in in Philadelphia. You know, I, I want to do yeah, something fun. Yeah, and then fun. get the fuck out of Philly and do something like adventurous. Yeah, like walking 1,500 miles. Yeah, I'm <laughs> sure not a lot of people do it, but no, a lot of people do it. Um, a 70 year old woman just what? did it. Yeah, last year or two years ago. Same guy. No. Oh. 70 something years old. Damn. Yeah, I'm gonna have to practice for that though. <laughs> for real. I go to the gym like every day, but I don't do too much cardio. I gotta start doing more cardio. Yeah. Do you ever work out? I walk a lot. Yeah. yeah. You definitely do walk a lot. Oh, you got the your old 270 sneaks are back. Are they at your house or something? Yeah. Okay. And I threw the mugs out because they were all fucking dick. Yeah. They stunk too. Mm-hmm. All right, sweetie. I'll let you go. We're going to, um, I'll drop you down. All right. Clearfield. Say bye to everybody. Bye, guys. <laughs> See you later.